The book of Ezekiel describes a vision in which the prophet Ezekiel sees a group of celestial beings. Ezekiel saw a great storm coming from the north, accompanied by a chariot and four living creatures, which were later identified as cherubim. Above the cherubim, Ezekiel saw an expanse, which was described as being like a crystal. Above the expanse, he saw what appeared to be a throne made of sapphire. On and around the throne, Ezekiel saw strange figures, which were described as having a complex form of wheels and eyes. Before we begin, we would like to say thank you for the support you show us. Kindly consider subscribing to our channel and like the video. Ezekiel 1, 15-18 says, As I looked at the living creatures, I saw a wheel on the ground beside each creature with its four faces. This was the appearance and structure of the wheels. They sparkled like topaz, and all four looked alike. Each appeared to be made like a wheel, intersecting a wheel. As they moved, they would go in any one of the four directions the creatures faced. The wheels did not change direction as the creatures went. Their rims were high and awesome, and all four rims were full of eyes all around. These creatures that Ezekiel attempts to describe are called the Ophanim. In Jewish mysticism, the Ophanim are one of the highest ranks of angels, associated with the sphere of Kitta, or crown, on the tree of life. They are often depicted as wheels within wheels, covered in eyes. These eyes are often described as being all-seeing, and symbolize the Ophanim's role as divine watchers overseeing the universe and its inhabitants. The wheels are sometimes said to be adorned with precious stones, and the Ophanim are sometimes depicted as having wings. They are said to be the chariots of God, carrying him wherever he goes. According to some traditions, they are also responsible for maintaining the cosmic order and the rotation of the heavenly spheres in Christian angelology. The Ophanim are also known as the Thrones, and are among the highest ranking of angels, along with the Seraphim and Cherubim. They are associated with the Celestial Throne of God, and are described as having a complex form of wheels and eyes. They are thought to embody divine justice, and are responsible for maintaining the stability of the universe. This vision might turn out to be very strange for us to comprehend, but we get to see the real nature and physical structure of the angels from the Bible, some of which are far beyond our understanding. The text says that their appearance and their construction was as it were a wheel within a wheel. The wheels covered in eyes, and they could move in any direction without turning. The sound of their movement was compared to the sound of a great host or an army. One would need divine grace to face such angels since from the descriptions, these beings would frighten anyone from their appearance and overwhelm our comprehension. The appearance of the Ophanim in his vision is highly symbolic and rich in metaphor. The wheels and eyes are thought to represent the Ophanim's role as divine watchers, overseeing the universe and its inhabitants. The sound of their movement is thought to convey their power and majesty, as well as the importance of divine order and cosmic harmony. Overall, the vision of the Ophanim is meant to convey God's power and the importance of faith and obedience to his will. Kindly consider subscribing and like the video. We appreciate your support.